this tent has been my home away from home for about five years now. It is a Kelty, and my twins had the two-man version that they really like for backpacking. And they went, well, I wanted to get a, a bigger one for kayak camping and taking the airplane out and camping. And, and this, this one is, I'm going to say, absurdly heavy. So, with the price being free, the colors are perfect. But it is not the colors that I would choose. The orange is too bright. The off-white is too too bright the green is way too bright this color I can easily see wanting in this color's location there are many things I like about this tent the way that the snap for the fly snaps to the tent is awesome the tent pole end and the grommet is very nice the tent bag is big enough that you can just easily roll the tent in, up and fit it in there even when it's wet. The pole bag actually fits the poles. The stake bag, in fairness, has stakes from another tent. I really like the freestanding tent. Um, it gives you so many more options on where you can reside. I very much like the external frame with the clips. They're easy to pitch by yourself and you can even pitch them by yourself in the dark. You can see how easy it is to pitch this tent. Um, I do prefer the kind that loop over and come back in so that you are in fact attached to both tent poles on this um, it's a square style external tent with the two poles. This tent has very little excuse to be heavy because it is almost all comprised of screen. It is a summer tent and not even a three season tent. It is all the poles that make it so absurdly heavy. I have had five tents that have been my second home. The last three have had door options, which I really like. This one here, the doors on the tent are exactly alike. It's just which way you put the fly that determines whether it is the door or the window. All four corners of the fly simply clip into the tent on the outside of the tent pole and when it is staked down that pulls the fly out a little bit from the tent which is very nice. The fly needs to be staked down um, to do the most good um, but it will stay in place as long as the wind's not blowing in. You can see the door without being staked down. It's just this loose floppy thing. If you pull it out, works really well. It gets the, any rain squalls or drizzle off the tent. Um, I do use a tarp, especially in November. Three or four days of constant rain and you are saturated without a tarp over the top.